Hey everybody, welcome back to Factorio. How's it going? Hello, hello, and welcome. And today, well, yeah, today we are um, going to do things. Great things, many things, a lot of things. Um, now, we are actually just going to set up our science so we can start continue with um, sciencing a lot of things, starting research. I want to get to logistics at least um, because we have actually pre-planned a couple of things beforehand. And uh, before we continue on, I want to say thank you so much for all the great comments everybody leaves me. It is really, really great to see that. And uh, I am really enjoying this uh, Factorio. The run is nice and decent. So we have a couple of tech labs that we can pop down somewhere. And uh, I've not much I've changed. I uh, just went ahead and cleared out the base over here that has been being tickled by the uh, pollution. And I did set up a row of guns over there, but I don't think they're going to see a lot of actions. Maybe if those guys decide to move this way, uh, they might run into there or go around this way. So, uh, yeah, I just have to keep an eye on that. And I do see we have some oil over here, which is really, really nice. But I did go ahead and pre-plant a lot of things over here. It, m it looks like a big mess, but um, I assure you there is logic behind this madness, this chaos. Um, so before we continue on with that, let's go ahead and put down our tech labs. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so there was one too many over here. Just fine. We could just get rid of those. Uh, so these ones aren't needed as well. Go ahead and plop down our labs right now. That we. Uh, this is the ultimate goal, is to feed these guys some science. And I cannot wait to get bots, because bots will make this process much, much easier. Much, much easier. Much faster. Go ahead and place down these guys. So, let's get started on our red science. So let's quickly take a look at the red signs over here. So all it needs is uh, one copper plate and one gear, iron gear wheel. I'm gonna shift right click and then left click like that. And like that. Good. And then it's gonna put you down. <gasps> you ran out of things. How oh dare I? Luckily, we have some being mass produced. You guys remember last episode? Okay, so you produce, um, I think, five seconds. You produce one. So we need one, two, three, four, five to produce one every second, theoretically. Uh, but we're going to double up on that. So we're going to get two every second, which is pretty nice. And then you just need one, one, right? Yeah, one, one. So plates, um, copper plates, we're just going to pull off from the main bus. And then iron gear wheels will be produced over here. So these guys are ready to receive their gears and plates. All we need to do is now bring down the plates, the iron plates, first. Now before we do that, let's just complete this. So as we can see, uh, the iron gear wheels are being placed on the far side. And where these plates are going to drop, these copper plates, they will be dropped on the near side, or on this side. So they will be on this side, like on the right hand side, according to our character, right? And the gears will be on the left. These guys are going to start picking the uh, things up. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to cancel that. I'm going to choose that. So that gets started. ASAP. All right, so we do have one, I wouldn't say really an issue, but we do have a bit of a, a thing going on. Like the we need two of these yellows to satisfy the... Um, Assembly machine over here. So what we can do is we can actually sort of start working on upgrading the uh, yellows into blues. So I've also gone and pre-planned this for us. It is not a difficult thing to do. Since we do have this little infrastructure over here, um, we can just, you know, add a little bit more. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. So what we want from you is we want the fast inserter. So they requires two iron plates, two electronic circuits, and one inserter. So inserters are being placed in here, which is not a bad thing. What I'm going to do is just do that. 
Okay, right, that is done. Please go ahead and resume that research for the steel pickaxe. As we can see, there is our first blue one. I'm going to let this run for a little bit before we um, continue on. So what I will do is I will keep the yellow ones on us for now. But I will come back and recycle these blue, these yellow ones for the blue ones in the future. Now for the green science, the green part. Fun little thing. Uh, it's sort of the same. But instead of uh, using... Okay, let's... let's Put one down and let's uh, let's uh, take a look over here. It needs one transport belt and one insert, and this time it takes six seconds. Uh, as we remember, the uh, reds take five seconds. This one takes six. So what we need is six of these on one side. So uh, one, two, three, four, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I'm just gonna quickly just do this. I messed that up. Okay, and then what we're going to do is just get where the main ingredients are going to come from. So, like I said, we need transfer belts and inserters. So over here, you and you. You are going to be the transfer belt, which just requires iron plates and iron gear wheels. You, my friend, you're going to be inserters. As we saw, inserters, sort of the same thing. We want gears on this side and then plates are going to be fed in uh yeah gears from there to here plates are going to be fed there and then this little snaky thingy is going to be where we're going to have our electronic circuits something like that so what i like to do sometimes is just have these lines end at plus minus a sort of the same place Okay, now for the big, big finale. Go ahead and plop down one you and you. How's the power doing? Looking all right-ish. It is picking up a little. I think what we have to do before we end off the episode is just going to go ahead and plop down one more um, power generation thingy. We can sort of do that. Let's see how's the power. Aha! Look at that. I knew it. Let's go ahead and upgrade our power a little bit more. Okay. Well, screw it. Um, that, that, that. We right there and there. And you are building up your steam. Too bad you can't click on them. You can click on these because you can in open there for inventory, but you can't click on these. Interesting. Yeah, I'm just trying to think. Maybe we can. Just yeah, maybe we can do one more. Not two more. Let's let's add two more engines. So one, two, three, four more engines into steam. Steam dudes, steamy boys. Let us come down here, and we'll have you there, there, and oh, okay, it did consume the plate. That's that yeah. and how is that coming along how's our power looking now three to one lovely we just doubled the output of our power we should um increase it a little bit more at least fill up this row before we uh maybe i should just do that like just make a massive amount of those steam engines and things and then we should be golden for a very, very long time. Well, not a very long time, but still quite a long time. Hey, these guys have uh, run out of resources. This one and this one. Ah, can you believe that? Alright, let's uh, go ahead and plop uh, a few more down. That. There we go. Okay. Well, that is that for today. Thank you so much for joining me here on Factorio. Hope you guys did enjoy today's episode. And I will see you guys next time. Take care. Bye-bye.